Now that you've drawn your stripes, the first thing you want to do, which is not what I'm doing here, but the first thing you want to do is erase your line of symmetry, your straight vertical line going through each vase or bottle. You need to get rid of that so that it's not visible through um, some of the lighter shades that you're going to be using. And then you're choosing any two to three colors and you're shading each stripe in one of those colors. You're going to want to shade in the same direction the entire time. So whether it's up and down or side to side, you're going to want to stick with that direction the entire time you're shading. You want to make sure that you're creating a gradient. So you're using multiple values, but you're going from light to medium to dark in a very smooth motion, creating gradation. If you've gone too dark too soon, you can always use an eraser like I've just done there to try and remove some of the color and then bring some of it back in if you'd like. You can start nice and light and then just keep adding more and more darkness until you feel you have your darkest section followed by your medium section and then your lightest section. You can see I've chosen a monochromatic color scheme but you can use any color scheme that you would like for any of the vases. So I didn't realize that at this point my iPad died. So you don't get to see me shading the rest of the shapes, but you can see them here as the finished product. I've used different color schemes for each, shading from light to medium to dark on each one. And here is another student example of a work in progress.